And we're looking at yet another couple of cool mornings for the Brazos Valley as we start this upcoming week off on the right terms. But it will be a breezy start to the week as well with winds out of the north at about 10 to 15 for your Monday. That'll mean some drier conditions around the Brazos Valley and perhaps some elevated fire weather concerns for the region with those winds gusting to about 20 to 25 on your Monday afternoon by around lunchtime around 10 to 15 but we'll have plenty of sunshine in place so it should be a fairly nice day but it will be a little bit on the cooler side with highs only in the lower 60s. Now temperatures will start off on the cool side on Monday morning in the low 40s but by around lunchtime we should manage to get up into the mid to upper 50s in the afternoon like I mentioned will be a cooler one with highs only in the lower 60s and quickly falling to around 50 degrees by 11 o'clock tomorrow night. Now there is a couple of solutions for rain later this week, a couple of options. One model, the GFS, uh, the American model, wants to bring some showers into the region on Thursday into Friday. Here's that pinpoint forecast. By around Friday or Thursday evening's commute, maybe a couple scattered showers moving through overnight into early Friday morning, then pushing on out of the region. However, the European model has other things in mind, maybe a passing shower or two, but generally just cloudy skies and maybe a few isolated showers through Friday evening into next weekend. We'll keep a close eye on that scenario, but right now we'll keep it at about 20% chance for some rain Thursday and Friday. And then as we head into St. Patty's Day, it'll be breezy next weekend with that chance for rain going up by Sunday.